If you previously used an LMS that was Common Cartridge compliant, you can bring content from that previous LMS into Haiku. Here's how to do that. I'm logged in as a teacher to a new class that I just created called Calculus. As you can see here, I don't have any course content in my class yet. So by default, I have a home page that's called First Page, and my content area is empty. I previously used a system that was Common Cartridge compliant, so now I'm ready to bring in those files. So to do that, I go to Manage Class and choose Import Content. In the new window that opens, I see the note from Haiku that it accepts Common Cartridge. So now all I need to do is find my Common Cartridge zip file. So I just click Choose File, and I happen to have that already ready. Calculus zip file. So I click Choose, and now I'm ready to upload that curriculum content into my Haiku class. In the next step, my Haiku class tells me that the cartridge is ready to be inserted and gives me a quick overview of what that cartridge contains. So I can review this information to make sure it's the correct cartridge. So in this case, I see that it's the brief calculus cartridge and it includes my description and the keywords that the cartridge contains. And the window also shows me what pages and blocks will be imported. So this is a page called Limits, Instantaneous Rate of Change, and the Derivative. And if I click to expand, I see the blocks that will import. In this case, there are a few HTML blocks, like objectives, destinations, and so on. And there's also one assessment. And those are things I'll verify when I run the import. So I'll go ahead and click Import. And now my Haiku class is importing my content. And I can see on the screen that this may take several minutes, depending on how large a file I'm importing. And it also tells me that I'm able to close this window if I'd like and do other things, and the import will continue in the background. This file was pretty small, so it didn't take long. So the screen reloads when it's finished. I can see that my information is successfully imported. So I can click this arrow to expand and see what imported. There are the five blocks we saw several screens ago. So it looks like those imported correctly. And I will close my window and check that. Back on the main screen, I can see that now I have a new page that we'd seen earlier called Limits, Instantaneous Rate of Change, and the Derivative, which we expected. And so if I click on this, I should see content blocks. And I do. Here are the four HTML blocks that we'd seen listed in the small window, subjectives, so destinations, and so on. Scroll down just to see what's here. There is also one assessment in the cartridge. So I will check that just to make sure it made the transition. And it did. So as you can see, the common cartridge import process is fairly straightforward. And it just really lets you take advantage of work you've already done in other systems as you're getting started in Haiku.